are visiting here um, a machine company in Denmark uh, called Westrop, uh, who has developed um, several of these uh, equipment and machines for uh, for cleaning of uh, of small seeded grains like uh, like quinoa. So we are very happy that we uh, have the chance to to be here, and uh, our host today will be uh, Gasely, uh, who will show us uh, the the process here. I'm trying to show that we are cleaning this uh, very, very dirty uh, quinoa. This is the process of pre-cleaning the quinoa. It's so important the quinoa uh, will lose the largest impurities and became pre-clean before it will be brushed or polished because of the sur uh, losing the surface of the seed in order to lose uh, and get rid of the saponin and the other material sitting on the surface of the seed. So here we are showing that uh, with the right decision and chosen uh, screen we have uh, already chosen here, round perforation as a scalping screen and the next scalping screen uh, slotted with the different sizes and then at the bottom we have the sand screen to remove the smallest impurities. Here are pre-cleaned quinoa, which is now ready to go to the next process. In this process, we will brush the surface of the quinoa. So here the product is coming inside the machine. I have turned on the vibrator and the product is coming inside the machine. And here is, uh, here is the mantle, the right mantle and the right brushes we have chosen. And the right uh, speed of the brushes will help to achieve a good product. So here we are showing the results of brushing and polishing at the, on the surface of the quinoa. As you see here, this is the pre-cleaned material, which is already we have pre-cleaned on our air screen cleaner. And now these products came and they brushed in our organic brushing machine. So now we are finished uh, with pre-cleaning. After that, brushing the quinoa. And then we have fine clean uh, to remove the other the smaller impurities from quinoa from our air screen cleaner. The finished product from this machine again coming to have a separation on the indented cylinder. Long separation will help you to, to, to separate from long and longer, which is mean here, the long will be the quinoa. All the longer from the long, which is mostly grass seed, the long grass seed and foreign seeds is gathered here. I can show you here as a sample. And quinoa with other still uh, some other impurities coming here, which will be fine cleaning the, uh, on the gravity table. Now we are going to fine clean it according to density and a specific weight. Because here we cannot, we still have the product in the same length, uh, same, same width and same uh, thickness, but they are in the same weight. So in that case, the product could be separated by some wheat seed or light material and some quinoa with no germination. You still have some, uh, you still have some uh, small uh, wheat seed that you would like to make it better. Then a uh, color sorter could help you to remove that as well. I really want to thank uh, Gazelle for uh, showing us and giving us a demonstration of how to clean uh, quinoa in the best uh, possible way. We started with a very, very dirty material and we ended up with a very clean uh, material as we see here. Thank you very much. You're welcome.